Hi guys, so today we're doing another review on a set of targets and it's the Target Nastery 01 23 gram steel tip. Uh, very excited to try these out. These look absolutely fantastic. Now Target sent these to me to review on their behalf, so thank you very much to Target. So without waiting any further guys, because I'm very excited to try these, let's have a close look at the packaging, a close look at the darts, then get these thrown onto the board. Okay, have a close look at the packaging. See it's got 90% tungsten there. It's got this grey, two shade tones of grey, and you've got the nastry very faint up the side here. You've got your SP for Swiss Point, you've got your Target Darts logo here. So all in model steel tip, 23 grams. Normally in this section here, you used to get the, the picture of the full dart, but they've changed this. And it's very cool because you get to see a close-up of the grip, the pro grip uh, shafts, the flights, again, a close-up of the grip and you get to slightly see a close-up of the Nano Swiss points just here. So on the back, you've got the Nastry up the top, Swiss point. What's in the box is you get three Nastry 90% barrels, three Pro Grip shafts, three Vision Ultra flights, three Swiss Nano 26 mils silver points, and one Swiss point tool. Again, it's the old one model, 23 grams got the logo there and these are the different models but what I'll do is I'll bring that up close so you can actually see it. So your model 1s, 2, 3 and 4 and it tells you the weights down below. So the O1 models 21 grams to 23, the O2 models 24 to 26, O3 is 22 to 24, so O4 is 21 to 23. So depending on your weight category that you use, that's the different types of models there for these. So what we'll do is we'll have a look inside. So again from Target you get the foam packaging, you get your three darts fully set up and you get your Swiss point tool. You also get your little uh, label, your 23 grams on, that's printed on this. That's your guarantee. Let's have a close look at the dart itself. As you see it's got that nano Swiss point. Goes into the tapered nose area. Now these barrels are further refined by the addition of silver PVD performance coating overlay and sandblasted which is placed inside and throughout the milling segments. It gives that a little bit extra grip. Yeah, it's got a different sli slight part into this, almost like a knots and crosses right in the middle there. Before it goes back in that diamond shape all the way up to the back. So the length of this barrel is 50 mils and the width is 7 mils. Okay, so first impression of these barrels, uh, really nice. I do like the feel of these. It's a good 4.5 to a 5 on a grip for me. Uh, not an aggressive 5. I know sometimes with a grip level of a 5, a high grip, it's usually quite sharp and quite um, aggressive when your finger touch and that. But this is not, it's almost like a Velcro kind of feel to it. Uh, not overly sticky, so I'm hoping it releases without sticking to my fingers. But they feel really nice in the fingers, so hopefully I can throw something decent. So game on. Oh, where are you going? <laughs> there we go. It's a weird way to do it. 98. It's just getting used to that texture of the barrel on my fingers at first. Um, it did feel a little bit sticky, but I think I just need to hold it gently. If you're a tight gripper, I think you might have issues with the release, but if you hold it gentle and you're just as a placement in your fingertips, you should be able to throw with these. So if you hold it really tight, then when you go to throw, I think you'll have issues. So if you've just got them placed, hopefully you should be fine. There we go, just placed. Not really doing nothing with it. 100! That's a lot better. Just have them placed and don't squeeze them. And then throw. Nice. A 60, nice dairy 60.
the nano tip points are sticking out the board really well. Yeah, I don't think these are quite aggressive, so shouldn't it do too much damage to your board. Oh, look at that, 41, it's just hanging in there. No, 43, sorry. Hanging in. That was a smooth point, that'll be on the floor. That's points lost. There you go. Forty one. Oh. Eighty five. Hundred and forty. Right, we'll leave it at that. Let's do a little summary. Okay, so the target darts Nastray 01, 23 grams. I uh, absolutely love these darts. These are absolutely fantastic to throw with. I did have to change my grip slightly. Uh, I must tend to grip slightly, put too much pressure on it. But if you just leave them placed in your fingers, they just comfortably stick to your fingers and they release perfectly. If you're uh, over gripping, you squeeze tight, I think you might have issues throwing these. Uh, but each to their own. These were perfectly well balanced. I do like the style. I do like the Nano Swiss points that came with these. Uh, I'm glad it's the uh, Nano Swiss points and not just the plain silver points. Uh, it's nice to see Target doing something different with their points. Uh, just due to the fact that the silver points, to me, are just rubbish. And then putting the Nano points on, they're listening to the customers and they're just taking this forward. So my eyes, Target has done the next level with these darts. Uh, they're beautiful to throw us and there is another three models out there if you don't like this style of model. And there's obviously different weights for each model so do check out that as well. You purchase these off the Target website. These cost just under £70 now um, which is a little bit above the average price for a set of darts but it is Swiss points, it's nano and the machine cut on these uh, just speaks for itself with the quality on the barrels. I'll leave a link in the description box below where you can purchase these. Don't forget to check out Target's other 
new darts that's just came out in the launch. Again, thank you to Target Darts for sending these out to me to review on their behalf. So thank you very much to Target. That's it from me guys. Hope you liked the video. Don't forget, click that like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Turn on your notifications for any new reviews and live streams and I'll catch you in the next one. Have a good guys.